Hey everyone, I'm here at the Mill Pond with my sister. I apologize for this not being 1080p, but I didn't have a chance to get my GoPro out. We got this fish right here. Hello. This is a master angler size bullhead catfish. And um, I helped my brother. Yeah, she, um, my sister saw the rod going and I said, grab it, grab it. And she grabbed it and then I reeled it in. And I here it is. It yep, she got it partially. So, yep. A little bullhead catfish. We're going to get a picture of him and get him back in. Bully. Second bullhead of the night. This one's probably about, probably about eight inches, I'm going to say. Last one was 14 inches on the dot. Master angler size bullhead. I'm going to get this one back. Okay, everyone, I'm just kind of looking down here. We already caught two bullhead. Um, but yeah, I haven't gotten anything definitive since I've turned the GoPro on. Um, nothing has really taken it. But yeah, what can be expected is that you go through periods where you'll have a good, you know, steady bu um, bullhead bite and then periods where nothing happens at all. So it's typical. Oh, God. Really big one. Whoa, that's big. Whoa, that's your angler. Yeah. But how many inches is that? We'll do it. We'll see in a second. Wow, that's that's probably bigger than the last one. Go get the go get the thing real quick. The what? The the, the ruler. We're gonna measure him. It's over there. Right there. That's two master angler sized ones. Two in one night. Can I release them? Um, pliers, please. Okay. They actually bark a little bit, in case you didn't know. Bark? Yeah. Rough, rough. They could, they, because they shoot water through their gills. Oh. They're, I mean, air through their gills, and they can. Rough, 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 rough. They don't do that. Keegan, you gotta get that hook out of them. I got him. Don't worry. It's just a little baby. No, this is a big one. This is a. Come on. This is as big as they get. Come on. Stop. Wow, nice fish. Good job. Oh, thank you. Good time tonight for catfish. Oh yeah. yeah. Some of the best tasting fish too. Them and bluegill. Delicious. Oh yeah. Yeah. Hey Lucas, look, they got a catfish. Yeah, we got him up. Awesome. He's a professional fisherman. Look at that. Oh. Ooh. Still alive? Oh yeah, definitely. <laughs> He's a. This could survive a nuclear bomb. Let's put him back. Look at that kid. Are you catching that the back? Yep, putting him back. We got one that picked it up right here. There we go. And. Get him. Come on. Here we go. You got him. Come on, reel him up. Reel him up. Yeah, yeah, I see him. Come on. Fight pretty hard. Come on. Come on. Wet. Nice catch. 
Thank you. How big is that? It looks like the same one. Whoops, I don't want to step on your rod, kid. You might want to get out of the way. I'm a shiny. I'm a shy. You're not going to be on video, so just. I'm a shy. Hey. Here we go. We've got another fish at last. We've got another fish at last. Wow. Oh, that's pretty hooked. Uh, don't choke him. I'm oh, not. I'm just getting the hook out. <laughs> this one's probably about the same size kit as the other ones. So. This is a bullhead. What? This is called a um, bullhead. Are you called What's bullhead? Up, oh, hey man. Hey. Uh. Oh, I haven't caught one of them since I was a kid. I didn't know they're still even around. Yeah. Uh. That's Levi. He's very friendly. Come on, back with the fish hook, buddy. Here we go. We're gonna release them. I got a pet them. I pet them on the top. They're like a bar of soap with uh, fins. I know. But their stomach feels like all squishy, squishy. I'm not. Goodbye. They sort of smell.